Hello everybody and welcome back to Promise Gaming and more Kingdom New Lands. I was about to say Crusader Kings 2, but that's not what I mean. Kingdom New Lands, Island 5. We're getting pretty close to the end, I think. Um, I mean, we've survived pretty well thus far against uh, some retaliations from my opponents. So, uh, you know, we may have lost a couple of knights kind of in the process earlier, but for the time being at least, I think we're uh, in pretty good shape. Just would like to get a little bit more money, and then uh, maybe we should go ahead and take down the last portal on the right-hand side, if it is, in fact, the last one. Uh, which it may not be, but if so, that'd be great, because then I can go ahead and farm out the right-hand side of the map, get as much money as I need to, and then start working on the ship. At which point, I mean, we're really close to being done with Island 5, and we could just end the series, I suppose. Which I'm sure some people would rather I didn't do, but to be honest, the views on the series have kind of been dropping off gradually, which I don't blame anyone for, it's just how it is. Um, I think I've been doing a pretty decent job with the game, but, you know, there's just some games that get a lot of attention and some that don't, and... Whoop! Oh, hi are you. Freaking popper. They look like zombies just chasing after the bread. It's like, oh, delicious carbs! Look, I understand, I love bread as much as the next person, but seriously, calm down. Anyway. Yeah, the views, it's just the kind of game that I guess not a lot of people really care that much about, and, you know, that's fine. I've been having a lot of fun with it, but um, I think I've more or less gotten about as much as out of this game as I feel like I want to. Because, realistically, um, I've seen most of the new content. I mean, now that we've got these Ballista Towers, the only thing I've been missing out on is Winter. Whoops, I appear to have lost all of my Knights. Ah, that's interesting. Uh, did I not buff them? I thought I buffed them. I may have forgotten to buff them. Oh, well, I guess that slows things down a little bit, doesn't it? Well, hopefully they're able to make it home. Hi, are you? No, don't take the coins for this guy. Morons. Yeah, hopefully they're able to make it home. Uh, I'll rehire them. I mean, at this point, it's just a loss of money. Not much more than that. So we'll survive this night, and then I'll probably go looking for them. Let's go ahead and get these knights back up and running. There we go. Anyone eating my bread? Nope. Bread is safe. Nice. Give me all the sweet, lovely coins. Many coins there is to be had. Alright. Uh, let me think. Hmm. Do we need to buff up my archers again? I mean, we recently went on an attack. We might be okay. I don't know yet. I'm just curious what's strong enough that's actually killing them. You know? Um, kind of surprised by that. Let's go ahead and buff up these knights. That appears to be as strong as they're going to get. Yep, that's as strong as they're going to get. Okay. Well. I guess I'm going to send you all on your trip now. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Go, go, go. Alright, let's go make sure that the shrine is buffed, so then I'm going to run out there, try to catch up with them, find any of the guys who might have fallen. And then revive them all. Get a little bit of money along the way. Sing the bells, bells, bells of Notre Dame. Hmm. Alright, yeah, we do need to buff up the shrine one more time. Glad I checked that. Let's go ahead and do it twice, just in case the ensuing retaliatory attack... Uh, lasts for a bit longer. You never know. Things like that can happen occasionally. Anyone else got money? You got a bit of money. Looks like you killed a lot of rabbits on your way over here. All right, let's go chase down the uh, the uh, attack force that I sent out. Make sure that they can survive. These ballista towers really are awesome. I'm not sure what people are complaining about as far as the angle of them. I mean, if you have your standard building location with a wall just a few yards in front of it, you seem totally fine. I mean, if you built your wall, like, and maybe if you built way out here, where the rocks just kind of spawned in an unfortunate location, I might understand the problem, but... Hey, guys. Good try, good try, good game. Go on, head home. Go on, head home. Well, you just look downright desperate, don't you? Yes, you do. Let's make sure we upgrade the walls as well, just to be safe. One, two, three, four, five, blah, blah, blah. Now, what I'm curious about is, why did only three people come home? I sent out a full force, didn't I? They didn't set, like, spawn a flyer that ate them or anything, did they? Ooh, that would be scary if so. 
Very disheartening, in fact. Hmm. Well, there's the force. Okay, good. We haven't missed much. So let's watch. Let's watch what they can do. We have fully buffed knights, fully buffed archers. This is as strong as we're going to get over here. Let's see what happens. Is it going to be enough? I don't know. All at all. In the meantime, we're charming some deer because that's sort of what we do. Ah, hello. You're under attack. Whoa, lost a lot of coins already. Either that, or we just killed a. I think we just killed a deer. Wait, why are you guys attacking in such full force? Holy crap! That's way stronger than you should be. Let's go ahead and drop some coins. Make sure they get all buffed up. There we go. Hang on. Okay, rehire you. Wish I had a little bit more coinage than this, but... I mean, if they're going to attack that strong, that wasn't like the night wave, surely. Okay, hang on. Hire you, hire you. There we go. Oh my gosh, look how many people! Oh my gosh! I wish I could, I wish I could save them all. But alas, I am only one man. I wish that these retinues hunted. If you would kill the deer along the way, I'd feel a lot better about this. I don't know. What if I just lose this force? Be kind of disastrous. But you know, they, they, I mean, Island 5 is supposed to be tough. Hey guys, sorry I don't have any more money. You're just gonna have to live with what you got. They're supposedly bred off of that away. It might st still be there if you are very quick. There's a lot of deer out here. Okay, there's the portal. It appears to have taken no damage whatsoever. Well, <clears throat> let's sort of see what happens. The knights are ready. So far, so good. As long as they don't lose the coins, we're fine. Well, why did they die the first time? This is easy. This ain't nothing. We won. We got it. Okay, well, whatever. Head home, guys. Head home. I don't know what your predecessors were doing, but clearly they were all a bunch of dummies. They deserve to die. I shouldn't have rehired them. They all deserved exactly what they got. Unless I sent them out during the day and it takes so long to run across the map that they got caught out during nighttime. Well, now that would be interesting. The map is so large that if they... Wow, maybe, actually, now that I think about it. Maybe it just took that long to run to this side of the map. So they couldn't set up a good fortified position. They got hit by an entire wave. In which case, having the dog telling you which side is going to spawn enemies would actually be very, very helpful. Because then I would know, okay, if they're attacking on the left, now it is safe. I'll have two full days to send the attack force on the right. Is that how that works? Because if so, that's a strategy right there. Possibly. Uh, I don't know. Now, if that was the only portal on the right, then the only attacks we should be facing now will be coming from the left. If that was all. So, uh, I haven't explored that far to the right. I probably should do that sometime soon. Wait, no, I did, didn't I? Did I find the pier? I think I might have found the pier on the right-hand side of the map. Oh, no, wait. When I explored to the left, I found the cliff face. Never mind. All right, we got a bunch of gold. Uh, let's go ahead and get myself a whole bunch of archers because we're missing quite a few of those now. There we go. Let's go over here, pick up some more money from this force. Hey, you ate all of my bread, you selfish jerk. There we go. Take all of that. There we go. Ah, money, 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 money. Money, 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 money. Here we go. All right. More bows, more bows. Lost so many troops. Thank you, guys. You know, one of the advantages of having the farmers come home was that they drop off all the money for you right here. So convenient. All right. Are we going to get attacked on the left-hand side? Because that's what's supposed to happen. Supposed to. If we get attacked on the right-hand side, I'm a little bit more concerned. Because that means that I've missed something, and there's probably one more portal off to the right, which would suck. Well, my knights haven't arrived yet. When my knights arrive, I'll know that it's about time to be attacked, because they've got to run that long ways. It's quite a trek. Quite the trek. Whoop! Oh, well, that's an early warning sign. Fire! Pew! <laughs> oh, skewered. It's hilarious. Pew! Could have aimed down a little bit. These guys with the masks are far more dangerous, Mr. Ballista Man. Oh, that was a shot and a half right there. Okay, can we kill... Wow, that's a lot. Wow. Wow. Okay, are you going to aim up? 
Um. Um. Oh god. Oh dear. Okay. Hi. Uh, so far so so kind of okay. Just worried about the flyers. Um, don't steal my don't steal my engineers. Don't steal my workers. Ballistas. Okay, we're managing to kill something. A little bit more would be good. A little bit more would be good. Oh god. Okay, there goes that. Well, that was a little bit unfortunate. Looks like we're gonna lose a couple of men, including one of my workers for the Ballista Tower, but otherwise, considering how strong that wave was, um, that wasn't so bad. We actually handled ourselves fairly well. That was pretty minuscule damage. I am pleased. In the end, I am pleased with how that went. We should have a few extra workers to spare. Very good. Let's get ourselves a couple more bows, because I'm pretty sure I have some extra men somewhere. And surprisingly, the baker actually had the foresight to run away. You know, I was told they were stupid, but maybe they actually did a patch. Updated the AI a little bit. Why'd you guys run off? Did we get attacked again? The workers ran off to the right. Usually they only do that if they see enemies approaching. Yeah, we probably got attacked on the left-hand side of the map again. But we appear to have held it off okay. Oh, we did lose a catapult. I should probably rebuild that. Eh, I don't have the money for it. Okay, well, we'll worry about that later. In the meantime, though, back to full strength. Day 21. That's right, guys. Sprint out there. Kill the rabbits. Kill the wabbit. Kill the wabbit. I miss Looney Tunes. That was a golden age right there. The kids of the next generation will never understand. That we all were raised with wanton cartoon violence. Dynamite exploding in one's face. All the sorts of stuff that your parents would never let you see nowadays. Oh no. But it was good fun back then. A simpler time. A less politically correct time. It was nice. Ah. Well, anyway. Alright, we need money. Uh, if anyone's got money, speak now. Or forever hold your peace. Um, your piece of gold. Don't actually hold on to it, though, because I want that. And that would be theft. Um, as far as I'm concerned, your entire livelihood belongs to me. Regardless of how uh, how hard you may have worked for it, this is, after all, not a capitalist society. The uh, the means of production are owned by the state, i.e. me, not you. So don't even try, man. Do not even try. All right, I'm going to explore off to the right because I want to see, is there anything else to the right that I've missed? If there are no other portals, then I'm going to focus all of my efforts on getting the money I need to rebuild the ship and start pushing. Because it's going to take a long freaking time for them to get over here, and you all know it. So, might as well get that process started as soon as possible, yes? I think so. Hey, Winston Jr., Winston clone number two. Whoever you are, hey, we'll hire you. And you. Okay, that portal's down, good. What else we got over here? Please, no more portals. No more portals? I mean, it looks like it's clearing up to me. And the pier. Okay, that's it. Three on both sides for Island 5. So basically, it's about the same level of difficulty as the original game. That's cool. Hmm. Alright, well, I think we need to get home um, as soon as possible because it sounds kind of scary. The music is uh, taking a turn for the worse. We might be under siege sometime relatively soon. But, again, though, this does tell me that I need to focus all of my efforts on farming out as much gold as possible so that I can rebuild the ship. In fact, I'm totally okay with focusing a little bit more farming on the right-hand side now because I know that I'm not going to be attacked over there. So we should totally do that. <clears throat> my voice. Woo, hello. Yeah. Um, I think that's a plan. I think that's a pretty good plan. And we shouldn't have any more retaliatory attacks because that's all the portals I'm going to destroy. So, the Blood Moons from here on out, yes, they'll be ramping up in difficulty, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're going to be a problem. Well, speaking of Blood Moon, it is now Blood Noon time, apparently. Did that gold coin just disappear? I was unaware that gold coins could disappear. Or maybe the bunny ate it. Is that possible? Is that a thing? It could be. On Island 5, I feel like there ought to be a little bit of a higher difficulty, though. Higher difficulty threshold. 
Like, oh, you destroyed all the portals, but you're not safe. They shall rise out of the sea. You know, something like that. That'd be kind of cool. Fire! Eh, there we go. Pew! Now well, my archer shrine is not working, but... Should be fine all the same. Um, I never did rebuild the catapult. Let's go ahead and fix that. Because I'm going to need it. And a behemoth's already here. Well, this is actually a little bit earlier than I was expecting for a behemoth. On the plus side, he can't throw any rocks because there aren't any rocks from a catapult. Well, there we go. That was easy. Bye-bye. Not bad. Why did you stop? That's the second time he's done that. As soon as I cross that flag, he's like, Oh, no, I don't want to go that way. Shut up. You will do what I say, you stupid behemoth. Okay. Did I see a beggar? There is a beggar over here. What are you doing here? Go home. Go ahead and get some pieces of the ship going. Save myself a little bit of resources, though, because I'm going to... Um, I'm going to want to uh, upgrade some farms. We will probably want to go ahead and activate the bread. Somewhere in the world, a peasant was sitting at his campfire... And his head just popped up, his eyes went wide, and he says, There's bread! He got up and started running through the forest at maximum speed, screaming like a banshee. That's what just happened right now. That's what I prefer to believe was just happened. And you can never tell me otherwise. Yeah? Totally. Alright, we need to get some more scythes. Farms are going to be a fairly reliable source of income at this point. There we go. It's about all I can afford for now, but... For now, it'll have to do. Now, of course, I have a whole stash of money in the bank right now. I'm not going to bother with it, but it's there if I need it. Uh, let's see. Any money? A little bit of money there. No money over here. We have plenty of workers, which is good. I like having a lot of workers on my side. Doop, -ba doop, -ba doop, 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 doop. How about you guys? There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now, I'm not going to upgrade the farm here, because I still want those guys to come home. Oh, see? There's the guy who came screaming like a banshee. I told you he was on his way. Uh, it's so amusing to me. I don't know why, but it is. <laughs> Bread! Sweet, lovely carbs! They go straight to my thighs, but I don't care! Good on you, man. I would rather live a short and happy fat life then then lo live long and miserable eating nothing but kale and quinoa. Personal opinion, of course. There's a fine balance to be made. I'm not being completely serious, but at the same time, I'm also not being completely joking. Part of me would prefer that. Hey, look at that. There is also supposed to be a farmer's shrine, by the way. I think I mentioned that there is an archer, uh, a knight shrine last video. There is a farmer's shrine somewhere. We have not unlocked that yet, but it does technically exist. All right, I can travel around on the right-hand side of the map, and I got nothing to worry about. So let's go ahead and knock down some more trees and see if we can't free up another farm. I think that would be a good use of my time. Would you agree? You might agree. But then you might not. But I wouldn't know, because this is entirely a one-sided conversation on YouTube. It's actually kind of lonely in here. Does anybody love me? Does anybody care? Does anyone even watch this thing? Supposedly you do. YouTube tells me you do. But I have no idea who you are. For all I know, YouTube's just making that number up. You may not actually exist, is what I'm trying to say. And I have no way of proving it. Alright, so here's the deal, right? At this point, we've cleared out that side of the map. Um, I'm going to be building up some more farms, but we've clearly survived a Blood Moon. It's going to escalate in difficulty, sure. But we're also going to be escalating in our defensive capabilities as well. So, I think for now, what I'm going to do is just work on building up the ship and getting money and pretty much just ending the game because, really, what else is there to do? Right? I mean, you know exactly what's going to happen. It's the same as everything else. Turtle down, build up, send out the ship, wait two weeks, done. Game over. Have fun. I think that's what's going to happen. So what I'm going to do now then is I'm going to uh, skip ahead until the ship has arrived and we are going to end this video and uh, we're actually going to end this series. I will see you guys in a little bit. 
Go forth, my men. Look at them. They're so eager and happy. We gotta kill things! Yay! Well, I guess at long last, we are coming to the end of this journey. A couple of things to note in between. One, I found the hunting dog. Uh, it was trapped underneath a tree, whining piteously. It was actually uh, a very, very sad thing. I threw a single gold coin at the tree and it broke, and the dog was free. Unfortunately, it then got carried away by ghouls in the next attack because I didn't realize they would literally grab the dog, put it over their heads, and run away. Well, that's exactly what happened. I also discovered that, yeah, you absolutely can just uh, build ballista towers out in the middle of frickin' nowhere. You know, out in, uh, outside of the safety of the walls, and the little guys can't get them. So, you risk one worker, but uh, have the chance to kill a bunch of little guys, maybe do a lot of damage to some flyers or behemoths, and you're totally fine. So, I don't know. Some interesting strategies involved there, but that is the end of Island 5. And we seem to have gotten through pretty darn well, I would say. Achievement unlocked. Crowned. What does that mean exactly? Day 33. Took a long dang time to get the ship all the way out here. And those are the end credits. Would you look at that? Huh. We weren't able to get to um, winter at all. But even at day 33... The, uh, the leaves on the trees have not been turning to, uh, to, uh, to orange or autumn or whatever I'm trying to say. It's not been autumn yet. It's not fall. So presumably I have a long ways to go before winter would even begin. So, uh, oh well. Anyway, guys, that is the end of Kingdom New Lands. I do hope you are enjoying this series. Uh, I think it was a pretty good update to the game. I like the progression. I like that some new stuff has been added. You know, uh, the only, th you know, the game's a little bit easier now, I think. But at least there's some new content to kind of make it easy, and I do like that there's a progression system. The only complaint I really have about the game is that it can be needlessly slow sometimes. Pushing the ship takes for freaking ever. It's like if there were another win condition, just like destroying all portals plus building the ship, and then it's presumed that you have enough time. Destroy all portals, the crown is safe, because there are no enemies that will spawn here. You don't need to build the ship. Or alternatively, for the harder levels like this one, just build the ship and hightail it out of here. The crown is safe. I mean, either one would have been fine. I don't know. Something to speed the game up would have been nice. But uh, all in all, I had a really good time. And I hope that you guys did too. But that is where I'm going to end this series. What did we unlock? Please tell me something, Unicorn. No, we got... I have no idea what that is. We got something. Huh. Yeah. Anyway. All right, I have to end this series here, but thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed. If so, then be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, letting me know what you've enjoyed in this game. Maybe you've discovered something that I have not. And of course, subscribe if you want to see my future content. My name has been Provis, this has been Kingdom New Lands, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.